Did I YouTube? I know there's a lot of people out there who want to join the Australian Army Cadets or have joined as recruits. And this is just to show them, like show all of you what you will get issued with when you do join the Army Cadets. This is specifically for the Army Cadets. I'm not sure about the new Air Force Cadets, right? This and I'm just a recruit right now, so this is the very basics. So there's no none of the red ribbons or the slouch chat or any of that. Okay. So in 2020, this is what you will receive. And I'll do a, I'll go over them more thoroughly soon. But first I'll just tell you the basics that you get. So the very first thing you get issued with is your shirt. Right? They measure you up, they get you a shirt. This is what they look like. I'll go over, over them after I go over all the stuff. So you get in my unit, I'm not going to tell you my unit, it's in South Queensland, we got, uh, well, I got two pairs of shirts along with two pairs of pants, okay, coming over to the pants, this is what they look like, right, really nice army pants, two pairs of those as well, as I've said, <clears throat> then something that you get later on is, well, on the same night, obviously, is the jumper. Right, so here's the jumper machine washable. Right, it's got the badge already here. Okay, it says Australian Army Cadets. Yeah, that says the same thing. I think that's a symbol for the South Queensland Brigade. I'm not sure. So, okay. Um, another thing you get is I'll just remove this. It does not come with that. Bush hat. It's either this or a giggle hat. Okay. I was lucky enough to get this. Some people do get the gill hat, not as good. Okay, these are really nice. Went fishing with it today. Really, really nice. Really good quality as well. I'll just go over this right now. Pretty basic hats. You've got little holes on the side here, right? Inside, there's there isn't much. You've got the little loop. By the way, you're supposed to wear that in the army cadets. Something that my captain told me, you're supposed to wear that behind your head, right? You know, wear it in front, in the army cadets or the army. Does that becomes a hazard, choking hazard. Moving on. The very last thing you usually get issued with, your bag. Okay, I'll go over it later. Now, I know most units don't do this, but my unit did. So, got issued with a vest, okay? It's camouflage vest. Uh, put it right here. Uh, sorry if my room's a bit messy. I'm not prepared for this right now. Something that most people definitely don't get issued with, but we were issued with. Yeah, actually, it's an Australian Army cadet. Australian Army jacket. Okay? Jacket right here. And then you also get issued with... I know this didn't happen before, but it's obviously the 2020 version. Is the belt. Okay? This is what the belt looks like. Right here. It doesn't come with this stuff. I'll go with this later. You have to put it on yourself. If you want a video on how to do that, let me know. It's pretty simple. Well, not simple. It's, it's alright. This. Right? What else? Oh, and then you get given a accessory pack. Let me see if I can find it for you. Yeah. At least I did. So this has the strap for your slouch chat when you do receive it. Um, as a recruit, I'm just get that in focus. As a recruit, you don't receive it, right? You receive that only after you do your course. For me, it's I'm very lucky with of COVID nineteen. I'll finish my course in like three months. Usually it's a lot longer. But you also get, at this I got, two shoulder patches. Australian Army Cadets, Australian Army Cadets, okay. Right, no, don't have the flag or that stuff just yet. Okay. You also get this Rising Sun badge. Also for your slouch chat, right. Um, has the two things behind it, I'm not sure what they're called. <laughs> To go on your Snapchat. 
Right, this thing's pretty weak. I'm not sure how well it works. And then this stuff, you have to stew it on. It's not, uh, it's not Velcro. So, oh, by the way, you do not get dog tags. Don't, don't get excited. Right, those custom. Right. So now I will do a more thorough review. Okay. Oh, by the way, in the accessory pack, you also get this stuff. So this just two of these things and then two of these buckle things. Then I found it a bit tricky to put it on, but I figured it out. Okay. So the belt feels really nice. Really good quality, just like all this stuff. Army quality, obviously. Um, it doesn't hold too well, unfortunately. It's just it's the design of it. And it's for ceremonial reasons, so I guess that makes sense. <laughs> and then the jacket. I love the jacket. Um, unfortunately, I was given a jacket which is too big for me, right? I'd probably wear L or XL Max. This is a 4XL, right? I, I think I took too long to figure out what my size for, uh, was for the pants and the shirt, so they just handed this to me without asking. But, can't blame them. Okay. Australian Army logo right here. This is made out of cotton. That's cotton. I don't have the... How much should I do? This is not brand new. Um, obviously, it's made for the Australian Army. Not for us, but we got them anyway. Okay, March 9th. That's what who it was originally from. Crap, probably have to burn that out. <laughs> um, yep, Personnel Protective Clothing. That's the company. Um, here's a little thing inside, right? There isn't much inside. There's no... Like, there, there's pockets, sorry. There's pockets inside both sides really nice really heavy and really warm and then just like all the things in the army it has these little adjustable things on the side for your arms right if it doesn't quite fit you you can quit complaining it's like in the army you can't complain really nice goes with most outfits and then you've got two pockets right here right there's zipper pockets of course and piece of resistance Rank insignia. Funny thing about this, also has a pocket right here, which is really sweet. Okay, now the vest is just a camouflage vest, right? It's not much to it. It's not gonna protect you from anything really. It's just for looks. Um, so you've got zip goes up and down, right? Pretty basic stuff. You've got two pockets. It feels pretty. I don't know how to say it, cumbersome. Like it's not exactly what you would expect to get, but you know. I think they just gave it to me as uh, extra, whatever. Like, my whole unit got it, but you know what I mean. Anyways, that's the rest. Done with those two. This, no, I'm doing the third review, but no. If you didn't know. Okay. Um, here's the bag. Now, I know different units get different stuff. And obviously, depending on what time it is, or like what time of year, you will get different stuff, okay? So, you might not get this. This is the full bag. As it's known. Turn it upside down. Bottom is normal, right? It's made out of something pretty hard, which I cannot make out. But this you get brand new. Most of this stuff you get brand new, right? Unless like... Okay, I forgot to show you my boots. I'll show you them in a minute. But they didn't have my size in boots, right? I kept complaining. So they just gave me second-hand boots that fit me. And I did not complain. Uh, open these. Ah. And there you go. Right, you got two of these pockets inside, and you got a lot of space in there, surprisingly. Uh, that's just some information you can read that. Pause the video, go ahead. I'm not doing that for you, you know, kids. Welcome to the army. <laughs> Alright, there you go. This is really hard, like, I don't know if you can tell, but really good quality. It lasts you, like, I don't know, a long time. Something which I forgot to show you. Your boots. As I said. As I said. Got second hand. Because they didn't have brand new ones for my size. These are for um, army reserves. Oh, no. Yeah. These are for army reserves. Because we do have uh, a mud. Multi-use depot. So we share it with the army reserve unit. So anyways. This is what I got. Right. Really good boots. Really hard. They, I mean they're clean. They're fine. Right. Really hard at the bottom, obviously. Really, really nice quality boots, right? 
second hand, but like even if I pass to another cadet for like 20 years from now, it will be just fine, just as happy, right? That's the good thing about army stuff, might not be the most comfy, but it'll last you a long time. So this purpose. Okay. Something that you always, always get, no matter what unit, the jumper. With other stuff as well. So, thing I love about this jumper, these right here look amazing, right? You might not be able to tell um, when you first look at it, but they look amazing. Pretty sure that's the insignia for South Queensland Brigade, but I'm not sure. It has a name on it. I'm not going to show you that either. But this jumper is, well, it really, I don't like it much. It really hugs your figure, to say the least. It really shows off a lot, okay? Got Velcro shoulder rank patches right here. Let me just... Ah, it's really hard to make a video with one hand. Okay, there you go. There's not much more to it. I'm pretty sure you would have to sew on these patches. Um, if you did get it new, but... This thing was second hand. As well. It's very itchy. Very itchy. But... I mean... It keeps you warm. It does, it really does. Anyways, that's that. One thing, I did not get any socks because we ordered some socks from the army. But as we all know, the army system works amazing <laughs> and we don't know when we get them. So, you know, it's a bit of a bummer. Anyway, now these pants, my shirts are different. So I'll start with the shirts, I guess. Um, one of them, is a bit I don't like this one I like some more the patch is in the center and with this one the patch is on the side right and then the patch with that one is velcro I'll just show you both of them right uh, really really nice patch in the middle you got straps I mean velcro things on the side you've got two big pockets so right here and there's zip up pockets as well so they're really nice you got, yeah, these are pockets as well. Your straps are located on pockets. Okay. Um, at the back. Just amazing, right? Not much to it. Uh, and uh, the other thing is the same, right? The pockets are a bit different, but yeah. I think the picture of this one is a bit more old-fashioned than that one. Okay. To point now, just to show you guys. Um, I think pants are basically the same. Right. Got these things at the bottom. Keep creepy crawl uh keep your crawlies out. And also just to fit you properly, I guess. Right? Um yep, yeah, pretty basic pants, nothing much to go over them. Yep. Um just try and think is there anything else. No, no. So I've got two and a half months before I finish my course. When that does happen, hopefully I'll become a cadet. And I will not stay a recruit anymore. Okay? Now, when I was becoming a cadet, there wasn't many videos on YouTube about the Australian Army cadets. Now, there's a few on UK cadets and whatnot. Australian cadets. Couldn't find many in these. Now, if you want a video about how to wear it, uh, how to iron it, what's the point, blah, 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 etc., etc., let me know. Okay? I've got plenty of time, and I'm more than happy to make them if you want them. Leave a comment below. Like, subscribe, share with your friends, please. Um, yeah, if there's anything else you want, let me know. And see you next time. Goodbye.